a depressing 1970s sci-fi movie starring a guy in a turtleneck. We've gone far enough. I think we're safe from the corporation here. Adzin, look! <gasps> it can't be! No! We'll never defeat the corporation! They've won! There is one way, Adzin. You can shoot yourself. If it's the only way, I must. Be any other time. The world is going to end at midnight tonight. Y2K. Y2K? Haven't you heard? At midnight, every computer in the world is going to fail. Planes will fall out of the sky, and all the world's nuclear weapons will explode, annihilating the entire planet. No! Silly rabbit. Tricks are for kids. Ten, nine, eight. This is it. Six, five, four. Hold on tight. One, happy. A flautist, Peter. Well, I hope you're happy. Come on, kids, we can still make the party if we... Nice work, Lieutenant. Very festive. Uh, actually, sir, each of those lights represents a missile launching by itself. The pattern is just a coincidence. Holy crap! Anybody else? Of course feel? it is. If she says yes, you'll surprise everyone, just like you did on New Year's Eve. Three, two, one! Some animals give me boners! Wow, this is the future? Everything looks slicker. Hey, Lois, I found some double-sided tape. I think I can do about seven minutes worth of funny stuff with it. That should get us to the Meg Kissing Booth story. Well, things have gotten kind of lazy, huh? Hey, Peter. Thanks for letting me borrow your screwdriver set. You know, I just want to say how nice it is to be back here with y'all on Spooner Street. Oh, I guess things didn't work out in Virginia. Chris, I heard you got a D on your report card. Here's a cutaway. Matthew McConaughey is terrible. Good Lord, what's happened to us? Okay, maybe things seem a little off, but other than that, the world seems okay. Which proves my point. Me stopping 9-11 led to a world that's just fine. Well, I'll see y'all tomorrow. Brian, you might want to look outside. Oh my god! Ah! Ah! Oh, oh, pebble in my shoe! Pebble in my shoe! Pebble in my shoe! Nice work, Bry. Whoops. Well, at least Joe gets to be a cyborg. Freeze, Frogmire! You are out past curfew and therefore in violation of local ordinance. Ribbity. What the hell happened? Could I really have caused all this? It says here that the new American Civil War you set into motion ended up in a series of concentrated nuclear strikes all along the eastern seaboard. It killed 17 million people. Oh. Including Caesar Milan. No! Okay, okay, I, I get it, Stewie, I screwed up. All right, I shouldn't have altered the past, but is there anything we can do? Well, the only way to fix this is to return to the moment when we first arrived in the past and stop you from spilling the beans about 9-11. Okay, okay, let's do it. 